to inform forward and back. She stomps, she spins, she do -si does and Teresa Van Deven loves every minute of it. I'm having a ball. But dancing became harder for the active 57-year-old when she experienced hot flashes. She would have up to 20 a day. I was really feeling miserable and uncomfortable. Teresa isn't alone. About 75% of menopausal women will experience hot flashes, but can you prevent them? Dr. Bonnie McGregor recently discovered an unlikely link between women who had surgery that put them into menopause and children. The women that had children at the age of 13 had reported fewer hot flash symptoms. One possible reason is they might produce more oxytocin, the love hormone. Some of Dr. Katherine Guthrie's recent studies have looked at remedies that don't work. There are a lot of things that I think women need to be informed that, you know, what really works and what really doesn't. She found omega-3 supplements, exercise, and yoga don't relieve hot flashes. But one thing that did work, antidepressants. We saw improvement in more than half the women. Teresa participated in a study to test antidepressants for hot flashes. She went from having 20 a day to just a couple a week. My life changed, just changed. I wasn't miserable. I had a good night's sleep. I was feeling better. And now the only thing that's hot on the dance floor is her moves. I'm Vanessa Welch reporting.